In this video, we're going to tell you seven reasons why you should not get a blue Russian cat. Blue Russians have an iconic look, they're fun, they're loving, but they may not be for everyone. And in this video, we'll tell you seven reasons why a blue Russian cat may not be best for you and your family. If you're new to our channel, welcome. We make cat videos that are educational and entertaining. And by the end of this video, you'll know whether or not a blue Russian cat is right for you and your family. So let's get started with number one. At number one, blue Russian cats need physical and mental attention. If you're not around a lot or you don't have the ability to give them the attention that they need, then a blue Russian just won't be best for you. They love to play. They love to do all kinds of things with their owner. They don't just like to sit around or lay around like most cats. They're active and they want to be with their owner doing something fun. So they like to be played with. They like to jump up to their cat tree. They like to do a lot of different things. And if you're not willing to do this or you're gone most of the day, a blue Russian won't be the best cat for you. These cats want the mental and physical stimulation, and if you can't give it to them, they just won't be the best cat for you. At number two, blue Russians need a clean litter box. Now I know what you're thinking, this goes for any cat, and that is true, but especially a blue Russian. They like things spick and span, and they're so smart, they'll know when things not right, and they'll make problems in other areas if you don't keep their litter box clean. So this is just one small example of what you need to do if you own a blue Russian, but it's very important. So if you don't have the time, energy, space, or the ability to keep a clean litter box, then a blue Russian won't be good for you because they won't use it and they'll head somewhere else and it just won't be good for you and the family. The next reason a blue Russian cat may not be best for you is because they are vocal. They're not afraid to meow and get what they want. So if you're looking for a cat that's quiet and one that won't disturb you, the blue Russian is definitely not it. They're very vocal, know what they want, and they're not afraid to ask for it. They love food, they love wet food especially, and they'll make sure that their owner knows when it's time to eat. So if you don't want a cat that's noisy, a blue Russian is one that you should stay away from. The number four reason a blue Russian cat may not be best for you is because they are persistent. Just like we were mentioning them being vocal, they're persistent and vocal, meaning they're not gonna give up until they get what they want. If you're looking for a cat that's very vocal and tells you what they want, then a blue Russian is perfect. But if you're looking for a cat that's quieter and would just leave you alone at times, the blue Russian may not be it because they love to be around their owner and they want to tell you exactly what they need and they won't give up until they get it. Usually it starts with food or sometimes toys, but they are persistent and vocal so it may not be the best fit for you and your family. At number five, blue Russians are playful. If you're looking for a docile cat that's gonna lay around and leave you alone, this is definitely not it. They're gonna be jumping all over, jumping up on their cat tree, on the couch, up on you. They're active, they love to have fun. And if you're looking for this, then in the blue Russian is perfect. You're never gonna have a boring time with them. They're beautiful and fun. You can't get any better if you're looking for a cat like that. But just know that if you're looking for a cat to be a little more docile and to just hang with you, the Blue Russian probably isn't your cat because they're active, fun, and looking for adventure. At number six, Blue Russians don't like change. A Blue Russian may not be best for you if you plan on moving soon, if you're gonna do different things around the house, if you're gonna do construction. Blue Russians just don't like change too much. And I guess this goes for any cat, but a Blue Russian especially. So if you're gonna add a new baby soon or maybe another dog, a blue Russian is a cat that you get when you're settled in and things aren't going to change too much over the next few years. If you change on a blue Russian, it can lead to high anxiety. They can start spraying, doing things inside the house that's not good, scratching things that they're not supposed to, climbing on things they're not supposed to. So if you're going to get a blue Russian, make sure that no big changes are on the way. At number seven, they shed. So this is a good reminder for people getting a cat Instead of a dog, cats still shed, and a blue Russian has a thick double coat that will shed, so it's something to be aware of. Plus, their hair is a little bit darker, so it definitely stands out on furniture, carpet, clothes. Just know that a blue Russian sheds, so if you're going to get this cat, know that a blue Russian sheds, and that it may not be the best fit for you if you're looking for a cat that doesn't shed. We hope you've enjoyed this video all about the blue Russian, and we'll see you on the next one.